ako kakatapos ko lang maligo and it's currently 9.29 a.m. and it's October 3, 2022. So yeah, today is Monday and back to school na ulit. Next week is our midterms week. So I need to prepare for the whole week for our midterms of course kasi we need to make bawe nung prelims. Medyo unsatisfied sa mga majors ko nung prelims. So, I need to double time this midterm. So, that's what we are going to do. And, at 10 a.m., may pasok ako. Ang ingin na naman ng ibon. But, yeah, I didn't vlog for the past days. Kasi, medyo um, nag-reset ako. <laughs> nag-reset. Hindi. Na, parang tinamad ako. Because, for the past weeks, I've been waking up so early and then finished my um, academics as in I've been so productive for the past days and weeks and I'm so proud of that but at the end of the day I feel so tired last weekend parang I, I need to rest and I need to slow down with all the academics since I don't have deadlines so yon but it compromises my time for advanced reading and those things but i didn't regret it i just um chill watch movies go somewhere else so parang ganun lang yung nasa mind ko that time but of course hindi na nawala since naging part na ng routine ko yung pag um yung paggawa ng mga acad work which is a good thing though but yeah naging part na siya ng routine ko so from time to time during the weekend nakakapag ano pa din ako nakakapag acads pa din but no pressure na siya so parang hindi ko na tina time yung sarili ko na at this time dapat tapos na siya um, dapat mag proceed na ako sa next um, agenda but today balik na tayo sa tamang time to accomplish task i was able to accomplish one task earlier and then nakapag review na din ako uh, mga 45% nung dapat kong i-review for the quiz tomorrow and I need to do some readings pa. Systematic na ulit yung process ko and bumabalik na ulit yung routine ko. And I think for the whole month of September, I've been really 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 productive and I was so so happy about that and yun nga, yung patapos na yung September, parang doon ko na na-feel na. Super nakaka-drain siya. Super nakakapagod. But, I was fulfilled with all the things that I've done. And, I hope that I'll continue that this October until graduation and until board exam. I'll bring you guys with me as I study and I hope you joined me. So, let's be productive today again. And, let's end procrastination and comics. So, let's go guys. Super talaga nakakasad kapag bigla na lang nawala yung internet and you're at the middle of doing something tapos nawala yung internet. But I hope na-download ko. We have internet na. So, I'm gonna transfer na sa laptop. And yeah, we'll proceed.
this file is the sample problems that I'm preparing for the remedial tutoring tomorrow night. There is a solution here na, but I don't base it from how the author <laughs> solved that um, problem. So I'm basing it on how I will solve it. Tapos double check na lang sa solution niya if tama. So ganun. So ganun usually yung mga ginagawa ko sa mga problems. Hindi ko ginagaya yung solution nung nasa test box. But rather, I used my own way. That way, kasi mas naka, naiintindihan ko siya. And I know kung ano yung pasikot-sikot ng topic. So that's what we are going to do today. I'm gonna answer these problems lang para tomorrow. I'm confident and ready to teach um, my fellow BSE student. So yeah, hopefully they will understand what I'm gonna say. And hopefully they'll get it. Yeah, because corporate liquidation is one of the hardest um, topic in advanced accounting. But yeah, um, time lapse ko na lang kayo guys. Because para mas mabilis yung vlog natin. And yeah, I hope you can hear me because super hila lang ng bosses ko. Medyo inaantok pa kasi ako. I wake up super early, like 5.30 in the morning. And I sleep around almost 12. And I do that every day. Kahit weekends. Parang naging routine ko na siya. Which is a good thing. Because, you know, I need to be productive. 